smell like bus people. And what exactly do bus people smell I'm like? I'm just kidding. I can't smell anything from all that jazz salt. I probably should have mentioned this before, but is it okay if we don't talk at work? I'm scared people might think you hired me because you're my father-in-law. Well, I'll do anything you want, but just so you know, people aren't going to assume nepotism. They're going to assume affirmative action. Right on. Grandpa was right. Although Mom only wanted to be seen as an attorney, all people could see when they looked at her was affirmative action. <laughs> affirmative action is defined as the practice or policy of favoring individuals belonging to groups known to have been discriminated against previously. Everybody stuck up a freedom. JFK coined the term in 1961. Even though the group of people that benefited from affirmative action the most were white women, many people still thought it was just a program that forced companies to hire incompetent black people to fill quotas. That's why my mom worked so hard, so no one could question whether she deserved to be there. Hey, Jack. I just need to finish this work, and then I'll come to the staff meeting. Oh, we did it without you. But I read your argument, and it is actually really good. Today, we'd call this a microaggression. Actually. But in 1985, they just called it a compliment. Coming to lunch? It's Martini Tuesday. Uh, no, I need to keep working on this. Sober. Well, it was always Martini Wednesday. <laughs> <laughs>